every single time I wear it, my husband, he literally was like, if you keep wearing that, you probably will get pregnant by the end of the year. And I was just like, excuse me, sir. And if you're not trying to give off those vibes, please stay away. But if you are in this combo, top tier. We'll have him all over that neck. We'll have her all over that neck. We'll have them biting into that neck. If you're not wanting to take a bite out of me, I don't think that we're wearing a garon for you. I just want you to take a bite out of my neck. That's what I want. What's up, my cherry bomb? On today's video, I am finally sharing the most anticipated video of the year. I remember I made my Middle Eastern fragrance video when we was in the park, you know, setting up a different vibe, giving off a different vibe. Y'all wanna see a layering combo with the Middle Eastern fragrances. So I got y'all. With everything that's going on in the world, I know how hard it is to just drop 200, 400, 500 dollars on a bottle of fragrance. Like there's other priorities and I truly appreciate you guys for always supporting me and watching my videos. And that's why I always like to share the Middle Eastern fragrances, designers and celebrity fragrances. So that way there's a category for everyone. So that way you don't feel left out. It's not that easy to be dropping 200 on a fragrance, okay? So today I'm gonna be sharing with you guys some Middle Eastern fragrances that not only are super affordable they last long if you have a good five you can layer all of them together so if that sounds like something that you're definitely interested in go ahead and grab a seat go ahead and grab a drink let's get right into this video hey guys so my name is abby and on this channel we talk about fragrances anything that has to do with smelling good feeling good that's what we talk about and occasionally we do a little lifestyle here and there every you know monday or sunday i'll drop a vloggy vlog here and there so if that sounds like your type of vibe go ahead and consider subscribing It's definitely free turning on your notification bell is also free too and putting it on all will also be free but it will give you all the notifications for my new uploads and I upload frequently okay so if that sounds like your vibe join the family I've done a couple of these videos so if you guys would like to catch up before y'all dive into the layering combos Go ahead and click that link. We're gonna go ahead and start with these. They are in no particular order, but these are some fragrance combos that I've came up with and that I've tried. And I'm not saying that I'm the original, okay? Because layering have been here before I was born, before you was born, and before, before a lot of people was born. So no one is the queen of layering. No one's the king of layering. We've been layering because the only way we were able to make fragrances is if we layered different notes. So yeah, so I'm not no queen and king of layering, but these are some layering combos that I've tried, you know, and that I love and I don't feel like gatekeeping, so I'm gonna share it with you guys. So the first layering combo is one that whenever I wear it, and I spray them on little pieces of napkins because I would get a headache if I spray all of this on my skin. But y'all, let me just tell you this. This is literally caramel, oud, rose vanilla sandalwood this is like a layering combo that i would wear if i was going out if i was going to go perform somewhere and i want someone to notice me if you're going out during the winter time and you're wearing layers of clothes this is the layering combo for you especially if you're a oud lover and this is also a layering combo for some people that didn't enjoy this fragrance so you start off with oud mood now this layering combo is for people that love oud mood and don't like oud mood at the same time because i know a lot of you guys probably Probably bought oud mood and didn't like the oud I'm looking for combos that would complement it well and a lot of you guys really love this and y'all just want to make it stand out a little bit more oud mood is perfect it has notes of caramel oud rose and vanilla this right here is such a pungent strong fragrance on my skin I get the oud but I feel like because I have over 40 bottles of oud fragrances from different houses I feel like this is not like the biggest oud fragrance but for someone that's super new to fragrances this could be like a very pungent strong oud that you probably don't enjoy so if you have this in your collection babe and you feel like it is too strong consider layering it with this fragrance a joie by latafa it just brings out the best of this fragrance it brings out the florals it brings out the vanilla the caramel that you was not getting when you sprayed it on in the beginning okay so if you sprayed it on and you felt like the oud was just too pungent consider layering it with a joie these two are beautiful they're sexy it's alluring it's grown woman or man consider laying these two so if you like oud mood but you want the florals the sweetness and the caramel and all that good stuff to pop out then put ajoad on top of it because girl and it does matter which one you layer on first so with oud mood i sprayed two sprays on this and then i would take two sprays of this and spray it off if i was wearing this today i would spray this right here right here right here right here the same thing on the other arm and then i would layer this with it 
one, two, three. And then when I'm about to walk out or whatever have you, I'll just take this and it's just do that. And then the same thing, do that on top of me. Because I always get those questions where, do you just spray half of your body or do you spray directly on top? Honestly, I do directly on top and then I do the whole body the same order, okay? So this layering combo is perfect for the girl that's trying to stand out. And it's also for the girls that's trying to get more of the florals and the sweetness from Oud Mood. If you find that Oud Mood was too pungent, try a joie. And a joie has vanilla it has sandalwood some citruses at the top it has rose it's the perfect rose and vanilla combo that i feel like everyone should have in their collection so if you felt like this was a little bit too feminine at oud mood you will not be disappointed the compliments on this is crazy and people are always asking me what am i wearing and i'm just like i'm wearing oud mood <laughs> with ajoad and i just write it down for them and they're like oh my gosh obviously the layering starts off with your foundation which is in the shower and your body creams and stuff like that yeah i know thanksgiving is literally right around the corner and if you're trying to stand out this thanksgiving this combo is literally the combo of the year for me i love it i've shared it a few times but i feel like a lot of people don't get it this is the time for you to wear this and i go in with camera first camera is spiced apples it is cinnamon it's praline it's vanilla it is so good everyone that i put onto this fragrance love it okay this will give you compliments it will have you smelling like your best self if you're trying to smell like thanksgiving or if i could associate thanksgiving with a scent this would be it this smells like the fall time i really and i mean i truly really enjoyed this fragrance and i think that you guys should have it in your collection alone it is a beast mode fragrance you don't need nothing okay you really don't need nothing because it's such a good one on my skin i get the cinnamon the vanilla and then i get some of that praline but y'all layering it with this fragrance right here will literally change the game casablanca my juice is dark because it's been sitting for about two years and y'all let me just say this a match made in heaven if you ever hear me say i'm wearing casablanca i'm probably wearing it with camera if you ever hear me saying i'm wearing camera i'm probably wearing it with casablanca usually i just put two sprays of each but y'all these two together will last 12 hours on the skin it will get you the compliments and baby when i tell you you will smell like your best self on thanksgiving day like if your family is super awkward and it's so hard to spark up a conversation i promise you the moment you walk into the room the conversations will start flowing because this fragrance right here is a staple these two fragrances together will literally have everyone wanting to bite into your neck literally just that good i love it love it love it and it's perfect for the holiday season not only for thanksgiving but the christmas season i love it y'all definitely need to get y'all one of these for real these two right here is a match made in heaven i love a good gourmand if you didn't know this already check out my gourmand playlist my vanilla playlist you guys know that i love to smell very edible very sexy very delicious i just want you to take a bite out of my neck that's what i want okay and this combo right here We'll have him all over that neck. We'll have her all over that neck. We'll have them biting into that neck. We'll get you so much compliments. It's such a gorgeous gourmand. I love this one. And if you're trying to give off that chocolatey, you know, rose, you know, vanilla, cacao vibe, this is it. I go in with Nabras first. Now, Nabras is a special one for me. It has berries in it and it's red berries. So the red berries are super rich and sweet. And then you have vanilla, you have cacao, you have a little bit of rose when i tell y'all it's mouth watering i don't be lying like it really makes my mouth water you guys know that your taste buds and your nose are literally like this close okay like literally like a thin line between the two and i feel like i could almost taste it it reminds me of a glazed vanilla cake or probably like a lemon cake as well too it's so delicious Ooh, and honestly it doesn't need nothing else but sometimes i just be feeling like okay let me amp up this fragrance a little bit more but when i do maybe there's no other fragrance that I would choose but this one. Choco Musk. <gasps> oh, baby. Baby, baby, yeah. This one will have you literally singing at the top of your lungs. It is so sexy. It's so alluring. If you want to smell like Nutella or like um cocoa, hot cocoa, during the winter and fall time, then Choco Musk is nice. It is beautiful. Oh, my gosh. It's such a beautiful chocolate. 
style fragrance and y'all it lasts so long i know a lot of people say that this does not last but baby it's been sitting for a year and i can literally just put this on and then come back home after an eight hour shift i don't clock in but you know like if i were out running errands and stuff like that oh baby i'm gonna smell myself when i come back home i promise you when i come back home my husband's gonna see me and smell me i don't know what it is some people it doesn't last long some people it does just let it sit and you'll see but pairing these two together is literally the ultimate gourmand fragrance i love these two together every single time i wear them i don't know what it is the chocolate gets a little bit more milky and then the red berries are just pulled out so much more it becomes like a fruity gourmand fragrance like imagine you have some cake vanilla cake to be exact and then you have like a um a syrup with the fruit still in it like and then you have the um raspberry syrup dripping over it and then you add a little bit of chocolate drizzle that's exactly what i get with this fragrance i don't know if i painted the picture correctly but if you want to smell like that then this is the combo that you need to wear okay because baby i don't know i don't know like i feel like you need to want to bite me like if you're not wanting to take a bite out of me i don't think that we're wearing a gourmand fragrance I, I want to walk by you and every time i walk by you you feel very comforted and warm and just inviting and that's how I smell whenever I wear this combo. Like people are so eager to ask me what I'm wearing. They are not shy. It's inviting. And if you're not trying to give off those vibes, please stay away. But if you are in this combo, top tier. Now this is another gourmand, but it's more of like a floral gourmand, like a fruity gourmand. And when I tell you every time I wear this fragrance, it just does not miss. And I just started wearing this layering combo because I just got this other fragrance. So I go in with affection and affection is literally one of my favorites right now it's one of my favorites it lasts so long on the skin it's such a beast mode fragrance it lasts eight hours on my skin in, okay this is an inspiration for yum pistachio by kaylee if you guys know this y'all know it's nutty it's fruity it's like gelato honestly if y'all want to amp up that yum pistachio or this fragrance put on a song gold put on a song gold because baby you will not be disappointed this is inspired by love don't be shy and a little bit of um oriana i feel like it smells different from both it still reminds me of both but it smells different from both but together the marshmallow the pistachio what the lily of the valley and raspberry in this what the vanilla honestly you guys when i discovered this combo i really didn't think i was gonna share it with you guys because i said there's no way you guys are gonna smell like this no i want this all to myself then i thought about it i'm like girl you are not a gatekeeper so you better put them girls on and i am and i did and y'all if you honestly i feel like this is probably like my favorite combo right now when it comes to the gourmands this combo right here is such a great combo every single time i wear it my husband he literally was like if you keep wearing that you probably will get pregnant by the end of the year and i was just like excuse me sir i'm gonna I'm I'm put a pause on that okay because this combo is such a mouth-watering combo and he's not the only one that's giving me compliments i've worn it for the third time what was it this week and i got compliments and i was just running errands so if you're trying to give off those sexy vibes and you like a fruity gourmand this is it this combo right here is beastly if you like fruity fragrances then this is your combo okay if you like pineapple if you like exotic fruits this is it. all her main love it triple femme now this one has that pineapple it has the fruity green apple all of those fresh fruity fragrances like you guys know this is super sexy it smells like a vintage for her so i was just sitting here one day and y'all know i love amber oud gold but my bottle is done this fragrance right here and this oud amar is literally a dupe for amber oud gold jardin exclusive and herbapura but baby when i tell you that these two paired together is literally a brain okay can't say the word on youtube but girl i love this this is like my signature scent right now like if i'm wearing this i cannot step out the house without wearing this if you're looking for a signature scent but you feel like everyone is starting to smell like a vintage for her put these two together they smell so good it will blow up a room it's like a fruity cocktail that just exploded like i feel like these two fragrances could not be any better until i put them together and i was just like wow how is this even possible the compliments on those two, sick. My husband wore that combo to work yesterday 
compliment galore. If you want to break someone's nose when you walk into a room, that's it because they will literally be on a chokehold. He got out the shower this morning and he put that combo on again. That's how I knew it was a banger. I love it. Y'all definitely need to check that one out. Now this one is for my fruity floral girls. If you like to smell fruity but you still want to be very feminine, this is the combo for you. So I start off with Yara Tous. Yara Tous is a fruity floral for me. I love it so much. It smells so classy. It smells like that it girl. It's just one of those crowd pleasing fragrances. Adding this to it literally amplifies this fragrance. Quaid Alpha San by Latafa. Oh my god this is the um, unlimited version. These two put together match made in heaven it literally smells like a tropical princess i love it because the fruity notes in this one is amplified with this and then the florals actually comes out a little bit more but with the creaminess of this get your life this combo right here will have them on a chokehold i was wearing this combo when i was in miami i shared that i was wearing this but i was testing out the combo with this that was the first day i decided to try them out and girl let me just tell you honestly either or would work perfect because I sprayed it on the first day with this and then I put this on top of it later on when I was getting ready to go to bed I sprayed this one down first then I sprayed that one on top girl so good okay so definitely check out this combo because you will not be disappointed at all what are some layering combos that you enjoy specifically in the Middle Eastern category okay these are some of mine and honestly I have a lot more so if you would like to see part two go ahead and comment it down below comment down below some combinations that you feel like I would love I I would love to hear your thoughts on these because Middle Eastern is my vibe. I love, 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 love them. Okay, everything will be linked in the description box below. If you found value in this video, go ahead and hit it up with a thumbs up so that way YouTube knows that I'm doing something good on here. Don't forget to subscribe if you made it this far. Join the cherry bombs. Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm super excited for the holidays. As you guys can see that my tree is up. I'm not decorating it until after Thanksgiving, but I'm super excited. So comment down below, let's converse, let's talk. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until we see each other again, Please, please, please stay safe and keep on smelling fragrances. Bye, chair bombs. <laughs>